That's right, ladies and gentlemen. Modern Warfare 2 has officially been announced. What you just saw is the teaser trailer for the game showcasing the full logo, the iconic Modern Warfare night vision goggle sounds. And there are a few hints and teasers for what's going to be in this game in those 10 seconds. No longer do we need to speculate what the name of Call of Duty 2022 is. You can see it right there. It is Modern Warfare 2 officially revealed by Call of Duty and Infinity Ward. And yes, this game really is called Modern Warfare 2, just like the original 2009 Modern Warfare 2. Only difference being we have the two Roman numerals now in the logo rather than the number two, but it's still Modern Warfare 2. Now, I don't know about you, but I am so excited for this game. All it took was seeing the green logo and hearing the iconic sound effect again to really get the hype going. Like I said, they have dropped a few teasers within that 10 seconds of things that you may not have realized were there because they are there for just one single frame. The first, and this is of course not a surprise to anyone, slowing down to freeze this frame, you can see the logo for Task Force 141. So that's a confirmation there that Task Force 141 is going to be in Modern Warfare 2. Just before we see the Task Force 141 logo, we see a set of coordinates to the right of where the green line is flowing down towards the logo. Between two and four seconds, it's really hard to make out specific details. But just before it goes into the logo itself and the Task Force 141 emblem pops up, we can see the coordinates a little bit closer up. Now, this is what we believe the coordinates to be. And if you plug that in Google, links to someone's blog post that showcases the exact coordinates pointing to somewhere in Singapore, specifically the Art Science Museum and the Marina Bay Sands Resort. And as you can see, there are three buildings with a massive boat balancing on the top of it. Now, that's a really unusual sight, but also to me, just feels very unusual for a location for Call of Duty to tease, specifically this early. But this correlates to the potential that there is going to be some portion of the game set in Singapore near the Marina Bay Sands Resort. Potentially a campaign mission or maybe a few, we don't really know. But that's what the coordinates look like they point to, which to me is really intriguing. But if you spot any other coordinates in this, please let me know down below in the comments. Now, if we go and look at what a lot of rumor and speculation has been saying about the setting for the game, most of it's actually going to be set in Colombia, revolving around Task Force 141 attempting to take down an international crime syndicate based in Ciudad Juarez, which obviously takes place in Mexico. If that's actually going to be what we get, we don't know. Those are just rumors, but that's what the rumors are saying. And we also know from the image we got teased last week that it's going to feature Simon Ghost Riley. We now know that the Task Force 1 for 1 are going to be in here, so we can pretty much say with confidence that Captain Price is going to be there along with Ghost. Judging by the ending of the Modern Warfare campaign as well, as the ending for Warzone with the Modern Warfare integration. So McTavish is also going to be there as well. And I'm really, really excited. Let me know your thoughts below. Drop the video a thumbs up and subscribe to never miss out on another video with the latest news when it comes to Modern Warfare 2.